Hello all, and welcome back to Let's Play some Diddy Kong Racing. This is Nox, and we're going to go ahead and get started. In the last episode, we knocked Dino Domain out of the ballpark. Actually, we failed a couple times on the boss fight, boss race, but that's okay. We're going to go ahead and get started and get some of these races knocked out. Diddy, you're so rude running into me. How dare you? My boost is better. Now you... Well, I'll probably take on the next lap just to show you guys that pirate ship over there. There's kind of a... Sort of like a secret to it. You'll see. So these are the hovercraft zippers, as you can see. Oh, man. I thought I was going to nail that wheel. I just rhymed two times. <gasps> Call me butter because I want to roll. Or you could just slap your monitor because I just... Yeah. I'm, I'm lame like that, you know. It, it's cool. Jump and check that shit out. Look at that. All kinds of shortcut. Oh, by the way, this is Whale Bay. I just rhymed again. Uh, I was trying to do that, though. Sorry. Alright, I'll stop. So here we go. Here we go. That was an example of the turn I was talking about last time, where I turned a little bit too much, and in the end it ended up stopping me so that I could only re-accelerate sadly because Pipsy is just kind of a little oversensitive on the, the handling but it's okay sometimes you can use the boost to her advantage though you can purposely turn a little bit too hard and then as you stop hit your boost and it'll automatically propel you back to boost speed I'm gonna go ahead and let this play through this will be the one for the episode yeah that's yeah sure sure what's up yeah what you got for us <gasps> another balloon that's right Oh my gosh. Yeah, I think I might actually go insane from watching those little clips there over and over. Alright, well anyway, let's do this. This one's called Crescent Island. This is actually pro one of my my courses that, that I approve of. Let's, let's put it that way. I think it's one of the, the better courses in the game just because I like the design. It's kind of cool later on to go race through a pirate ship, which is pretty awesome. Uh, the same as usual, if you hit the zippers on this one, you're pretty much going to win. Now, see this pirate ship I was talking about? We're gonna make, well, we'll follow the arrows, make a right, or left, not a right. Well, I'm dumb. Grab some bananas, make another one here. Now, that pirate ship, you don't necessarily have to go through it. Uh, I'll explain what I mean when we go, and when we're, we're looking at it in a second. Oh, actually... We have to grab the key on this level, too. Although, I'm going to let that... I'll just save that for the end. Uh, we'll... Okay, well, yeah, we'll just wait. Anyway, see the left over there? There's a water. On the right side, there's a wall. And I'm pretty sure you can't go along the right side. But on the left side, if you were in a hovercraft, you can completely skip this pirate ship. I used to do it when I'd race my friends <laughs> when I was little. And they'd get so mad, they thought it was technically... it was. It was cheating. It's, you know, oh my gosh, John, you're, you're cheating at the game. It's like, I'm not cheating at anything. I'm just taking the smarter route. It doesn't say you can't go that way. You know, whatever. It's not like I put in a code to unlock the left area over there. I'm not doing that. Yeah, there's a wall on the right, so... Psh, that is just smart by me. You're in a hovercraft. Why wouldn't you go over the water? What it does, you know? If you had a plane, I bet you'd just fly over the pirate ship. You wouldn't go through it, would you? No. But anyway... Sorry, kind of mini rant from childhood, I guess. I don't know. Something like that. Well, anyway, first place again. Kicking ass. Skipping scenes. Because we don't want to see that anymore. We go crazy. Let's do some Pirate Lagoon. The Lagoon of Pirates. Lagoon of Pirates. Something like that. So, here we go, here we go. Get ready and go, or fail. Now, I don't get a green boost on this one, mainly because of this turn right here. If you don't get that boost, that can be very, very bad. Here's a great example. I always hard turn, oh, or I mess it up like that one. Usually I hard turn left, and when I do that, I'm going to, wow, I am all over the place today. I'm going to hit the boost immediately after, so that I don't hit the wall. Wow, I am terrible right now. Okay, here we go. Hopefully I'll show you what I mean. 
So we're gonna get a green boost just because I need... Yeah, there we go. So hit this. Now I'm gonna grab the blue, make a hard, and use the boost. See how it, it brought me right back? Pretty awesome. It's a neat little trick. Part of the, the learning experience. I, I have done that so many times. Well, you wouldn't be able to know because I epic failed it and I keep... Wow. I'm all over the place. Alright, well anyway. Check out this, this course though. Got the water everywhere, which is awesome. Random castle off in the background. This tunnel here. It's just... I like this course a lot, you know, I like every course in this game. This game is just amazing as a whole. Everything. I wonder how that pirate ship got on that rock, though. Like, how bad do you have to be as a captain to do that? I made that one, that's pretty cool. I didn't run into anything on that. I went right over the ramp, nothing over. Hey, hey, don't care about you now, do we? Okay, so here we go, here we go. We might actually knock all these races out. As a matter of fact, we're going to. And then, I don't know where we're going to be. This race is pretty cool. You'll see. We have this cave we get to go through. This one's really fun on... Wow, I missed my boost. Probably because I'm talking. Oh well, that's okay. Bananas, bananas, bananas! Mr. Balloon, because... I don't know, Mr. Zipper. Wow, we're doing terrible right now, but... Here we go, we're in third place, we're in third place. There's Timber. I almost said Tibbers, not Timber, but Tibbers is a bear from League of Legends, not a tiger in Diddy Kong Racing. Zipper! Alright, let's do this. Gotta, gotta focus. This, this is too hard. Okay. Oh, let's go, let's go. We're gonna lose. Actually, I lied. This is way too easy. It's okay though. We got this. We got this. And Zipper! Okay. Man. Anyway, as I was saying, this course is actually pretty pretty fun uh, with planes. I, I thought so anyway. And I remember when I first played through this game, I thought of all levels, this would be the level that would have the key. But I was wrong. It was actually another course. A little Crescent Island course, I believe was the name of it. Which, actually, we're going to go grab that and then... Unfortunately, I have to end this. Although we could knock out the battle from the next one. We're going to skip the boss for now. We'll save him for later. I know. It's sad. But it's okay at the same time. Why, you might ask? Because... We have other things to do. There it is. Crescent Island. Go, go, go. Just want to grab the key and leave. Crescent Island. Let's go car, because we have to. Vroom! Vroom! Get my boost. Alright, so the key is really close. Right over here, actually, next to the start of the race. As you can see, there's something. Looks like a little cave over here on the edge. So we are going to... <gasps> what is that? That's a key. We're going to go ahead and return to the lobby. And there we are. We have the key. We can do the key challenge now, which, you know what? Screw this. I'm gonna cram another race in here. Not a race, it's more of a battle. But I'm gonna cram another one in here. Why? Because I appreciate you guys watching this, and I'm sure you probably want to see it. So, let's knock it out. Besides, we want another piece of the TT amulet. The last player remaining will win Darkwater Beach. If you think of Mario Kart battling, that's pretty much exactly what this is. So, the strat, the main strat I have uh, that I can offer is, well, the computers are not the most intelligent, but aside from that, you can pretty much just hide. You, you can let them kill each other off, and they'll normally leave the last, you know, uh, AI person with, see, like, I'm out right now, so I just got hit, but they'll normally leave them with four bananas or two, and each hit you take takes two bananas so you can actually just keep like you can see them on the map down there so I could just stay away from them if I wanted I'm not going to because well let's face it that's lame but you could stay away from them and just let them fight it out and then when the last one's low I almost hit that that was very scary when the last one's low you just kind of jump out and I come 
completely missed crunch because I'm bad. Oh my gosh. Conquer used to take his bad fur day and go somewhere else. Asshole. Okay. Look at Diddy Kong. Diddy Kong's at. Diddy is hiding. Look at him, he has eight. Okay. Alright, you know what? It is our goal. Oh my god, get off the wall. I can't concentrate because I'm talking. Alright, alright, here we go. They're not even fighting each other. What are they doing? Okay, Diddy is below me. And yeah! Yeah! Suck it, Diddy! Oh, I hope Crunch doesn't hit me over there. Nope. Nope, nope. Crunch, Crunch isn't the most intelligent NPC, we'll say. I guess he's, he's technically not even an NPC, because you can play him as a racer. Yeah. The most intelligent character, let's say that. And... Oh, oh wow. Look at that. Diddy had a shield, so it bypassed Diddy. And then it went straight for Conker, but then Conker had a shield as well. Just my luck. I wish I had a rocket there when Crunch hit me. Nailed him. Fire! Woo, that one went flying over. Wow, this is taking a little bit longer than I thought it would, to be honest. But it's okay. Basically, as you can see, I mean, it's pretty much the exact same thing as Mario Kart. You just run around collecting your power-ups and then... Bam! Bye, Diddy. So long, sucker. But anyway, you run around collect your power-ups and, you know, just build whatever you want to get up and then go find someone and shoot them. That's pretty much how it works. Let's see. Oh no, we can't let Crunch win this, are you serious? If I lose, I don't... I'm kind of scared that I'm going to lose. Oh, I hope so. Yeah, okay, got him. Okay, now hopefully one of them... Hopefully they'll find each other, waste their shot, and then I can take one of them out. Uh, shoot. Wow, I saw that they were close on the map and wanted to hit one of them, but no. Okay, let's go over here. Oh man, I am so scared right now. I have a feeling one of them is just going to nail me the second place failure again. Okay, here we go. I hope Cocker gets out, because Crunch is not the most intelligent person. Let's go. Okay. Okay, okay. Here we go, here we go. We've taken Conquer out. Wow, this is... I'm like over-analyzing. This is way too hard for my brain right now. Oh! Bye-bye, Crunch! Bam! First place, suckers! What's up now? Okay, sorry. That was probably a little bit more difficult than it should have been. In fact, that took way too long. <laughs> so now we get the second TT piece. So, we have two more to collect. Obviously, two more zones, two more key challenges. But anyway, guys, I thank you for joining me, and I will catch you next time when we take on the boss and complete these silver coin challenges for this area, too.